Yo, what's up guys, it's your boy Miss, and today I may, oh, I'm gonna make a tutorial for you guys. So, as we can see here, we have Goku, and we are trying to make some wallpaper thing, I can guess you can say. I wanna make it like this galaxy, so the first thing we do is grab a pencil, um, and yeah, start my marking out uh, what you obviously want. So yeah, let me just get this right. And the pencil, the shortcut is P on your keyboard. Otherwise, you can see the tool here on the side above me. It should be. Uh, so yeah, this is. I mean, this tool is like a trial and error because it takes a long time to to master it. It can be very difficult to use. Um, and yeah, if if this is a bit weird, this tutorial I'm making right now, it's because it's the first tutorial like real tutorial tutorial I make. I don't know if that makes, makes sound. But yeah, I will try to go more in depth with it so you guys can try and make stuff. But yeah, now I just got him selected and we gotta get all the hair with. So it doesn't look silly. Yes. Let's get all of it with. There we go. I press control and enter here or command enter if you're on Mac. So yeah, now we have Goku's face. Um, so what we need to do right now, we need to make a black or white Which obviously you can make in uh, the filters. I just usually use a uh, command shift and uh, What's called U To make it uh, trans uh, not transparent to make it black and white like this, but we need to up the levels which is Control L And we need to find a good ratio a bit like this and right now I'm just giving you guys the tools so you can check it out if you want to yourself, if you have Photoshop obviously. Um, so now we need to make a selection of all the black, oh well, that's just plain annoying, of all the black by using the magic wand tool. And luckily it detects all of it because it's only two colors. And if you press Ctrl J, you get that and we can delete the old layer. So now we need to get the selection, Ctrl and uh, click on the layer. And as you can see here, I can just duplicate this one from the galaxy and already you have something that looks pretty epic if I might say so. I really like this design. I, I like making these recently. Um, so yeah, uh, we can do some more stuff to it though. Um, what could we do? I mean we could do some brushes. Uh, I, I might just leave a link for, for some decent brushes that's obviously free. Oh. What do you think? Oh, this actually looks cool as well. Ah, uh, invert is not nah, invert is not good. Well, check this out. Uh, that's actually that's actually pretty cool. I mean, you can kind of see it, but yeah, it's, it, that that's not what we are going for. So yeah, just discard that. Come on, your work with me now. All right. So if you press S, you get the stamp tool, and then we can copy some of it to our brushes which is obviously B for brush and now we can put it in like this maybe a bit like up in the hair maybe like that uh, I might just need another one just a sec I need another brush something different because this one is just a drip one I, I mean there's a lot of brushes out here and this one is yeah this one Put one here as well. The problem with this brush is it's the same the repeats. I might just delete a bit of it, you know. I might just put it here and delete some of it. Yeah, let me do that. Let me delete a bit more. There we go. Great. Okay, cool. That's that's something. Um. So yeah, I mean now we can copy, uh, take these and merge them together. Uh, Command E or Control E, and uh, I try to invert this, but it doesn't look that good, if I might say so. I mean, you guys can try if you want to as well. I prefer the white one. The thing is, right now, if you want to do it like this, you can use an outer glow or something like this, like I'm doing right now. 
in the little effects, but this, I mean, it has some potential, but I'd, I'd ra much rather have like uh, the standard white with the galaxy thing here. Um, you know what? Let's change it back like this. Yeah, I think this just yeah this this is definitely it. All right, I mean, yeah, that's that's pretty much it. Uh, thank you guys for watching this weird t ass tutorial. I'm sorry I'm not going into much detail, but uh, I might just do it in another, another video or maybe even a live stream if you guys have any questions uh, so I can respond in real time. But yeah, up until then, thank you guys for watching, leave a like, subscribe if you haven't already, and uh, I will see you guys in the next one. Take care and goodbye.